Hey everyone, s -Dub Nation here and welcome back to a brand new Ninjago video here in the channel. I'd like to stop and take the time to rank my top 5 Jave scenes. Please note that everything that I will say in this video is just my very own opinion. My list is certainly not the right list, it is just my list. And you are free to comment down below your ranking of your top 5 J scenes. Like, comment, and subscribe and without further ado, let's get into our ranking. Kicking off my top 5 list, we have Jay Saves the Ninja from Skybound. Now, this season is actually Jay's season, and he has a lot of highlights inside of this season. Throughout this entire little action sequence, it's the ninja recruitments fighting off the Sky Pirates, trying to give Jay time while he was inside of the Gen Blade, trying to save the ninja. And luckily for them, Jay got out just in time with the ninja, and they form a plan to save Ninjago while also saving Nia in the process. And it actually gives Jay a lot more spotlight because he actually saved the entire team i think no other ninja did this except for jay well maybe lloyd but then again jay saved the entire team and the sequence itself was awesome at number four we have jay learn spin jitsu from the pilots now the entire team learned spin jitsu inside of this sequence but this sequence is actually the one that kind of proves that jay is quick on his feet because he's the one that discovered the key to spin jitsu first he's the one that discovered that the skeletons are just like the training course so why not use that ability that we have learned in the monastery here and it works it works out for jay and he learned spin jitsu first Kicking off my top three list has got to go to Jay finds his true potential from Rise of the Snakes. Now, I've always been a big fan of the Jay-Nia relationship, and I feel like this sequence right here kind of solidifies what I love about them as a couple. Jay is literally turning into something that he is not, and throughout the entire episode, he was acting like someone he is not. So I feel like with Nia confessing her love and saying that she loves him just for who he is, I feel like through that love connection, he finds his true self, and it becomes one of the most powerful arcs for his character. Our runner-up at number two, we have Cole versus Jay. I just think that this is actually a great action sequence with Master Chen pitting Jay and Cole together inside of the Tournament of Elements. But it was kind of weird to me, why would Cole fight Jay over Nia? Like, does Cole really love Nia in that way? I, it was kind of weird to me in Reboot It. I just feel like this action sequence is actually beneficial to both characters in a way that the dialogue is well-written. It just has a lot of stakes. The team is at risk. And both Jay and Cole have their own special character arcs inside of this sequence, but I feel like Jay's arc is more evident. Before I get into my number one, I like to take the time to say that if you are a fan of Ninjago, which you probably are, that's why you're watching this video, click that playlist up above for everything Ninjago related that I have in my channel. Also, if you are a fan of the MCU, I am doing an MCU rewatch on my podcast. It's called The Regular Podcast, and that link is always in the description and in the comment section, and we will be uploading Doctor Strange on Monday. Without further ado, let's get into my number one. But coming in at my number one has got to go to Jay's final wish from Skybound. Throughout the entire season, Jay and Nia's relationship has been building up to this climactic event. I kind of wish that this really didn't get rewritten inside of the series because it would have been very moving for Kai's character. would have been very moving for Jay's character also. I feel like Jay could have been the best character if they would have kept this season canon. But I just think that this season right here kind of proves to me, actually this sequence, and I just feel like this sequence right here kind of proves to me that Jay has the potential to lead his own season. He has the potential to have emotional arcs, and he has the potential to be one of the greatest characters inside of the series. I honestly just wish that they could have kept this sequence in here, but don't get me wrong, this sequence is a 10 out of 10 because it shows that Ninjago actually has stakes. After Nia dies, Jay's uses his final wish to rewrite everything that happened inside of the season back to the first episode, and only him and Nia remembers what happens, so it kind of solidifies their relationship as a couple and also saves Ninjago inside of the process. So this is why it has to come in at number one. Alright guys, that is it for the ranking. Please know that everything that I did say in this video was just my very own opinion and my list was certainly not the right list. It was just my list and you are free to comment down below your ranking of your top 5 J scenes. Like, comment, and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.